with her first practice under their belts, all focus should be on the Aggie season opener against Rice. But it was made apparent during a fall practice press conference Monday that all eyes are on Johnny football. For the first time in you know, my six years of being a head coach, no one's asked me about the new guys. Um, that the fact that we signed 31 players and all of them are eligible. Sunday evening, ESPN broke the story that a and m star quarterback and Heisman Trophy winner Johnny Manziel signed memorabilia for a five-figure flat fee. But senior running back Ben Molina says he and his teammates aren't concerned with the latest allegations. As a team, I feel like we're, we're going to embrace the spotlight. Last year we were the underdogs and um, this year we're the top dogs. We're just looking to show the world, you know, that we can be good and we can be great despite all the off the field issues. Senior defensive back Tony Hurd Jr. agrees. He says when they're on the field, it's all about getting down to business. He still has all the leadership qualities that he displayed last year and, and, and he's He's being more vocal now. You know, he's taking more of the leadership responsibility. So I think all the off the field issues, it doesn't bother us not one bit. If the allegations are true, Johnny could be ineligible to play. But his teammates say no matter what happens, come August 31st, the Aggies will be ready to hit Kyle Field. In Aggieland, Lauren Holman reporting.